Okay, so I was just doing a few calculations because I am frustrated with having to spend so much money on art paper. It's very nice art paper that I buy. It's archival. I buy Epson Velvet Fine Art Paper. And it's the cheapest I could find was at B&H Photo for $57.53. And that's for 4,900 inches, basically um, 20 um, sheets for um, that are 13 by 19. So <laughs> I calculated how much this paper is and it comes out to be um, 0 0.0116 per inch. So that means for a 22 by 30 piece of paper, uh, 22 by 30 inch piece of paper, And that would be $7.67 at this rate of how much it costs. So I was like, I was just curious. I wonder how much my watercolor paper is, which is much nicer. It's real professional. Um, I use Arches Cold Press, 140 pound. Um, so I did the math. It's $28.12 for 3,300 inches. That works out to 0 0.0085 per inch. So for a 22 by 30 um, inch size paper, that piece of paper would be $5.61. So that's quite a bit cheaper. If you're buying it a lot, especially $5.61 is a lot cheaper than the $7, almost $8 for um, the Velvet Fine Art Paper from Epson. And, uh, that's about a $2 difference, roughly, okay? So 140 pound paper is pretty good thick paper. It's way thicker than the velvet fine art paper. It feels, I mean, it just feels phenomenally better than this. So I was just like, oh, well, okay, let's do the 90 pound paper. The Arches Cold Press 90 pound paper. This is professional paper made out of cotton, rag, great paper. Okay, it's $3.99 for 660 inches, which do all the math, blah, blah, blah. For the same equivalent size papers, it would be $3.96. That's almost half the price of this Epson Velvet Fine Art Paper. And it's, it's going to feel better. It's real watercolor paper. When I print on this paper, it looks like a real watercolor painting. As opposed to this, it looks almost like a real painting, but this looks and feels really like a real watercolor painting. So I will be switching to the Arches Cold Press 90 pound paper um, because it's half the price and that can save me a lot of money for other great art supplies. All right, I hope this little tip uh, for saving money, if you print your own art prints, helped you out and you guys have a great day, bye.